Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The latest stable version of the Google Chrome web browser, version 90, is now gradually rolling out worldwide. So that means we have gone from version 89 to version 90 in this latest update. And I'm sure that if you haven't received yours yet, you will get your update of Google Chrome in the next day or two. I received my update this morning on the 15th of April. Now, normally with a version update of Google Chrome, you do get one or two new features. And the first um, significant mention with version 90 is that it is the first version of the browser now to automatically load all URLs via the more secure HTTPS protocol. And after applying the update to version 90, um, Chrome will now ping the HTTPS version of the website instead of the non-secure protocol, which is the old HTTP version of the website. So that is good to know. Just another little feature to make online browsing a little bit more secure. Now, version 90 ships with two new features. And the first one being it now has the AV1 codec. And the AV1 codec is an open source codec and it is designed to basically enable better quality over video streaming services. And as many of us know, in this day and age, um, a Google Meet, Zoom, Microsoft Teams, just to mention a few, are well in use. And this is a handy little feature now to enhance the video quality over those services. And over and above the uh, better video quality, it also reduces your uh, bandwidth and your data usage if you are, a, are using a mobile network. So that's just good to know that the AV1 codec will just make using those streaming services a little bit more user friendly. Now the next one is the next feature is window naming. And this was up until now before version 90 rolled out. This was you could you could enable this as a flag in Google Chrome. Now it is part of the stable version of the browser. Now, what window naming is, is if you go to your top right to the hamburger three dotted menu and you go to more tools, you will see now there is a new uh, header here called name window. And when that pops up, what you can do is the instance of Chrome that you are using, you can just give it a name and I'm just going to give it number one as the name. And then if I go open a, another instance of Chrome, and by the way, you can also access the naming of the window, window naming in the menu at the top. You just right click and you go down to name window. And I'm going to call this one two. And now as an example, a, a real simple example, if I hover over my taskbar where my Google Chrome instances are, you can see now that instead of saying new tab and new tab, I have my window one and my window two that are entered into the window naming, which just makes identifying your different windows if you have a lot of different instances of Chrome running a little bit more user friendly and the navigation a little bit more simple and quicker. And then let's just close this instance. And then just uh, the last uh, feature worth mentioning is that Chrome is getting a new APR based on the existing web XR device APR to improve the browser's experience in AR, which is augmented reality. So um, for those of you who use anything with the augmented reality, I'm sure this will be a handy little feature that will um, just improve the browser's experience in AR. And then obviously there, there are a lot of bug fixes and security uh, updates, which for that reason alone, you should update the browser if you use it as your main browser. I use Google Chrome as my, um, my main go-to browser. So I'm always making sure that it is up to date. And obviously there are the uh, numerous security fixes and little bug fixes that have been added in this latest version of Chrome 90. Now to see if you have the latest version of the browser, just go again to the top right to the hamburger menu and go down to help and you just click on about Chrome and if it hasn't done so already this will update you to the latest version of 
Google Chrome, which is version 19.0.4430.72. So that is the latest version and official build of the Google Chrome web browser for desktops. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.